week five. Next month. It'll be five next month, but he was here in about three weeks of age. Yep, three weeks of age. He had a brain tumor, a hemorrhage in the brain. He did. He was um, rushed here by ambulance, and it was three weeks. He was three weeks of age, and then he did get life flighted. But um, it started all here, and it was the emergency staff that worked so quickly. And 20 minutes too late, and it would have been really hard for him to survive. So how long was the treatment process? What did they do? Um, they got us life flighted up to um, Akron, Maine, for Dr. Hudgens for um, oh, yeah. emergency surgery. But it, like I said, it started here in the Mahoning Valley where he was um, treated with a CAT scan for them to find the initial reason what happened. Yeah. And, and so you got Dr. Hudgens and his staff who's amazing. Amazing, right? just amazing. amazing. Um, tell me about the prognosis. What did they first tell you when you were in that hospital room? Um, that it wasn't good, that he'd be a vegetable. Um, that's what they first told us. And even when he got his uh, brain bleed surgery, when he got his shot, they still said, we just don't know. Um, and we are celebrating his fifth birthday next month. So That is awesome. So tell me about the day when you realized he had turned the corner and he was going to get to go. Uh, it was two days before Christmas, so we got to come home. <laughs> <laughs> That's an amazing Christmas gift. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's a great Christmas gift. So you got to take it home for the holiday. We sure did. And, um, we still kept in close contact with here and the main branch. And uh, he, everything turned good. It just takes. It took time. So <clears throat> tell me about five years later. Five years sitting later. Sitting on your lap. What do you think when you see him? Let's say he goes to sleep tonight. You sit there because all parents do this. They watch their kids sleep. <laughs> What do you think? You know what? He's celebrating his fifth birthday. He's going to preschool. He's doing sorry, aqua therapy. He's just doing so much. Oh, You're a proud, proud mom. Sorry. Oh, it's okay. And this is brother down here? Oh, yeah. He's a big brother down here. He's our little miracle. Are you okay just sitting still like that? <laughs> Probably not. No. You want to go run around, don't you? He does. Uh, <laughs> So we're thankful for Akron Children's, we really are. Well, we keep saying all the time that if, if you wonder where your money goes, when you call 1-888-746-9890, it, it goes to keep your kids like in the house. Absolutely. And, and I know that sometimes that sounds a little melodramatic, but right? mm -hmm. you know, it goes through my friends who say, they did. They saved his life right here in this emergency room. So I'm very glad you guys came down. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you very much. And I'm glad you're doing all right there. Say hi, Grace. You're doing good. He's, we've got all these kids so hopped up on sugar from the green room back there. We have ice cream and cooking. It's amazing. Thank you guys. So Thank so you much. so much.